Check this list. Are you in this game now? I've, I've went through and painstakingly replaced, I think, every name with people from the comments of the first video. Uh, there may be some in here that I... Okay, there's definitely some that I missed. But I think I got all the names that were in the comments that I saw in the first video. So keep the comments coming. I'll go back into the second video and I'll go into the... Well, I'll just look at each video uh, for the comments to throw some names in here and uh, and get the stock names replaced. But you can see there's a bunch in here. So I hope you guys made it in. Uh, who's our amputee, by the way? That's That person is Walter Broham. Okay, I, I don't think that name has been taken. However, doesn't matter. We're getting it going. Now, uh, the current situation is the Londoners. We do have that as something that we need to play around with. We do have the House of Prayer. And it looks like I can just have these little sermons. And I should probably have these sermons because I need hope to rise. Right? So if I trigger this, hope goes up. That's good. Uh, and we'll do one. Oh, interesting. Okay, so it's one sermon. It just triggers at both. You know what? That's fine. So we'll keep an eye on that. Anything we can do to increase hope is going to be the way to go. Okay? Now, our automaton situation... We have him uh, either gathering or creating coal, whichever uh, whichever we think we need. Right now, he seems to be just gathering coal. Nope. He's, yeah, he's here. He's making coal, which is fine. He's going to recharge. No problem. Hope is dropping. Maybe there's some stuff in the Book of Laws that we can benefit from here. Let's look in Adaptation. Triage, anything about hope? No. Dueling. Probably not. I don't love that idea. It's going to reduce discontent. And each spontaneous duel will slightly reduce get discontent. But people will die, and that's going to cause problems. People aren't going to like if I sign in this, so I don't think we do the labor. Let's go into purpose here. Evening prayers. Okay. Okay. Each youth raises hopes and has a small chance of convincing a Londoner to stay. Okay, absolutely, I need that, that I, 100%. There's also shrines. You get shrines. Shrines raise the hope of people working nearby, and they increase efficiency in nearby workplaces. Oh, that's neat. That is very neat. I think I'm going to go evening prayers first. Okay. So now we have evening prayers. And it says it's going to cost 20 food rations. Evening service will be held in place of worship. People will gather to discuss and pray. Food will be distributed. Some Londoners may mend their ways. So let's do that. And let's see if the other one can also trigger that. So no, same idea. All right, cool. We're going to get together and pray. We'll, uh, we'll hit up those book of laws every so often here. And see what we can get done. Uh, it looks like I could probably close another hospital. Right? Like, this one's closed. That's the care house. Uh, that's fine. This medical post has two children, or two people in it. Let's shut this one down for now. Because we only have, we only have 20 being treated, so we'll keep three open. More scouched. Hello. Scouched. Let's do it. We have our team prepped and ready. Now I've got two. We're going to go out. Look at all these spots, man. Dang. Got winter home, the coal mine. All right. Let's go out here with you. The other one's coming home with a whole bunch of stuff. And now, now we got a choice to make. I think, I think going here is not bad. We got the sawmill upgrade. The wall drills, people were saying, is pretty cool also. This is like unlimited wood, basically. Which, obviously, that's... You're gonna want... You're gonna have to get to that, right? But with the upgrades, it's probably really important. Uh, but it does require steam cores. We do have some coming back, though. With the, uh... With the scout. So, maybe I'll snag that. But, like, I also can just build another sawmill, and it is upgraded. So, I don't know if that's... Is that the play? I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. So I guess we're going to keep an eye on our churches to see when these things are off cooldown. Pop those pretty much as soon as we can at any time. Now, I'm wondering 
because of this weather here in these coal mines, it's a moderate risk of getting ill. Suppose I should maybe do a steam hub here. At these outside areas. Okay, so we got four steam cores off of this delivery. That's insane. Yeah, okay, so that's that's pretty cool. So we'll run that, and we won't run the heaters, I don't think. And we'll send you back out in this direction. Shrouded cave. There's a faint wisp of smoke out there. Uh, or distant glimmers of sun reflected on the surface of the water. Oh, you can go back through these areas. Two days, 17 hours. If I send him here, that seems like it's going to be way shorter. So maybe if they've been on that path, it's sig it's a significant drop, it seems, right? Okay. People are sick. Mm-hmm. But as long as I don't have more than 30 sick, it should be okay. Also, look at our coal. Boom. I'm going to actually overdrive this for tonight. It's party time. It is party time. Keep everybody super, super warm. The Londoners gain more followers? Like, what? Low hope. I mean, I'm trying. I'm gonna. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best. I think the other thing we could do is try to upgrade some of these houses, right? So uh, that could be something that maybe helps a bit with that. What else is happening here? The wall drill, book of laws, two scouts. That's all good. Let's turn off the overdrive now. And we're on steam level two. Also. That uh, feels like maybe even overkill right now. But you know what? It's fine. Let's let's keep it going. Let's keep let's keep it going. Okay, so this place is not functioning because the storage limit's reached. So now we're going to take the automaton off of this, put on that. And out here we're cool, everybody's warm, that's what we want. And let's, yeah, okay, well, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to look at upgrading these, uh, these houses. Let's not get too crazy. Oh yeah, that just gets empty, eh? Look at how much he can gather. It's awesome. I'll turn that off now and he can go back to here. Storage near... Yeah, wow. Okay, so our coal situation all of a sudden... Like, I got a, I got a different problem. <laughs> I got too much of it. So I'll store some out here. Wall drill is done. Build the wall drill to extract wood from the ice wall. Yep. We are running out of the trees here, man. In this area. I'm thinking now I just push this back to here. And I'll let people build at night here. What's this? United by faith. We're holding an evening of prayer this afternoon. Plenty of people are here. They're praying, but also talking and laughing. It's really brought the community together. See? See, guys? That's what we need. More positivity in this world. More positivity. Okay. They've reached the American camp. Explore it for steel and steam cores. They're starved Americans, so the American camp was well supplied with everything except for food. Searching the tents, we found more victims of hunger. Most of them have badly worn but sophisticated artificial limbs bearing a company symbol Tesla manufacturing. <laughs> really? That's funny. We can only bury them and take their equipment. Ooh. Okay. I guess that's what we'll do then. Let's head out this way. So we're going to remove the engineers from here and put them here. Do this and we will 
dismantle this building. Guys, look at you're all getting new homes, man. Like, what else could I do? <sighs> Writing on the wall. Captain, someone's to face the walls with predictions of doom for our city. This is troubling. People already fear we'll share Winterholm's fate, and scared minds are swayed by even the smallest things. Send a cleric to reassure it. Yeah, I mean, hope will fall slightly, so that's fine. Let's do that. Tech tree. I'm actually just going to take this, the resource depot upgrade. Book of Laws. Let's go purpose here. And we've got the temple. So we can build a magnificent testament to the devotion of our people. It will kindle hope in the hearts of the faithful and sway the doubtful. Londoners may occasionally mend their ways. Discontent will occasionally fall. The temple brings peace to the faithful and inspires hope. It may cause some doubters to mend. There can only be one temple in the city. Yeah, I want that. Ceremonial service temple raises hope and comforts the discontented. Yeah, let's go. Let's go big into the temple. Big temple times right here. Big time temples. BTTs. Erect that temple. We should think of everyone's needs, not just the faithful. Sarah, I'm doing that. Okay? Do you understand? I need wood. Is what I need. We do need wood. Uh, how does that work? If I look at the wall drill, where do these go? Okay, so they go way out here. That'll destroy resources. I don't have enough wood to even build the road. Dang. Okay. The snow cliff. Oh, right. That was just our, our spot to get back. So we're going to go Shrouded Cave now. Wood is coming in. And we are going to connect that road. Okay. And for the temple, what was it? 40 wood? Yeah. It's a tier 3 insulation, too. This place is really inefficient because because everyone's going to build. Okay, fair enough. Well, I appreciate the efforts, guys, you know? Okay, resource depot upgraded. So we have a little bit of extra space everywhere. Explore this place. The center of the settlement is marked with an upright boulder on its roughly plain face. Someone chills with the following. May God forgive the genius who sacrificed human lives in the name of progress. For we can't. Exiles of Tesla City. We won't touch the monument, but we decide to dismantle the huts for wood. Okay. So steam cores are coming hot and fast. Walled colony. No movement. No smoke. So probably not people. Could it be open water? Ooh. Let's check here first. Okay. Tech tree. If I go charcoal kiln... This turns wood into coal. I don't think I want to do that just yet. This might be the time for us to go into drafting machines, right? Also, I have the, um, the hothouse now that I could start maybe replacing some of the hunter stuff with. So, let's, um... Yeah. Let's go into drafting machines at 75 wood here. Whoops. Now, I need people, I just realized. I am getting a little short on people. <laughs> uh, that said... Oh, what was I... What did I need to store here? Oh, yeah, coal. Okay. I do... I need people. Let me pull the workers from here, put engineers... I can put two workers there. Obviously not ideal, but maybe we'll find more. I actually like our current automaton setup. I'm a fan. And then we need a few more trees coming in here. How long on these things? Oh, nice. Let's have a sermon tonight. Let's do the food ration stuff. Absolutely. Hope is increasing. That's nice. 
Londoner's vandalism. Right. Okay, well, there's nothing I could have done about that. Let's go drafting machines. Now, I have two steelworks going. That is something I could maybe slow down on. And just turn that off for now and make sure that this place is maxed with workers. I think that's okay. And this place could use the heater. Although that is still not very good. That is not that great. So maybe I just go steam hubs. Like, are steam hubs just things I should be kind of... Spamming? Like, is that... Seems like it. And I should maybe move this down so it hits these other buildings, too. Well, actually, these are just hunter huts, so it really doesn't matter right now. So for that reason, I'm actually going to fix that. But we're going to start replacing those hunter huts with, uh, with those hot houses, right? So... Okay, so now we will turn this on, turn this off, turn this on. He's going to charge. Okay, this is fine. Children's hide. Oh, God. The cave is from a hideout for some children who were evacuated from winter home. There's no adult survivors. We should talk to the kids and take them to our city. Oh, boy. We talked to the children in the hideout. They said one night their teachers and some hunters took them out from winter home on a secret adventure. Teachers told them they were going to stay here for a while. When the food ran low, their guardians went back to get more and didn't return. Seems the kids were evacuated in time before things in their city got really ugly. So we could escort them back. We could send them on their own and some will die. Now, I wonder if we send them back and some die, is that going to impact us negatively because they're not part of our colony or they're, they're still, you know, maybe related to some of the people that we have? Um, God, that's a lot of children, but... Let's escort them back for this one. Form them into an orderly column and set off towards the city. They walk quietly and resolutely like little adults, the youngest clutching their tor toys tightly. This is going to be a long journey. Please have enough warm beds. Yeah, good point, actually. Frick, good point. Good point. I need wood. Another act of vandalism. Well, I have to just send the cleric, right? That's annoying. It's very freaking annoying. I also need to build a temple, so I need wood, guys. I need it. I need it badly. Um, I can actually run, I can, you know what, I'm gonna, 24 hours this, that's not gonna impact hope, that's only impacting discontent, and if there's no purpose of discontent being at zero, that's, I gotta use it, the way I, the way I think about it is like, that's a tool for us to manipulate. The cleric was beaten, great. Okay, a priest was assaulted while trying to reassure people. You'll have three days to establish the Faith Keepers. Hope will rise slightly. We need the Faith Keepers to strike back. Discontent will fall slightly. Pray for him. Hope will rise. Discontent will fall. The Faith Keepers. Interesting. Hope will rise here, too. The same as this. But maybe the Faith Keepers would be helpful to deal with stuff like this. To secure the streets. So, build and man the Faith Keepers. The heck? So that's going to be in here somewhere, isn't it? Oh, Faith Keepers is here. Okay. I can do that. I can do that. I can do that. No problem.
Londoners gaining followers? Frick, man. It's crazy. That's crazy. Where's my automaton right now? So this built. Wait, why is this building off? Oh, why did I do that? That's a mistake. I didn't mean to turn that off. Okay, they've reached the exile colony. More survivors here. Some of the exiles are still alive, just barely. We could try to bring them to our city, although they might die on the way. One of the dying held a diary. We read the last entry. Exiled from Tesla City with food and fuel running out, we sent the strongest among us to search for help. They're our last hope. We're afraid this refers to those poor Yankees we buried. Oh, damn. Rob them? Let's, uh... No, no. Let's... Let's... Oh, I have to either... Okay, so I can't send them back in this scenario. I'll bring them back. It's fine. Some of them stirred from the death-like slumber to bless their absent friends for bringing help. This is a lot of work. Like, we actually need workers and stuff right now. So, this is fine. We are we are losing a bit of efficiency here. But it's all good. Where's the next prayer thing? Nowhere. Can I build my temple now? Yes. Let's build the temple. I'll maybe just put it between the two churches very prominently here. Temple's been erected. There we go. Hope rises. That's a that's a pretty substantial boost there. And now I can say a long ceremonial sermon will be delivered at the temple. Hope will rise. Four day cooldown, 20 rations. Let's go. One of our people died? Whoa. Died in work accidents. William Bowen. All right. Is that our first death? First death? Whoa. You know what? People are going to die out here, okay? fact that we lasted that long, I think that's pretty good. So now we have to sign the cemetery or corpse disposal law. Uh, we have to wait for that and that's going to that's gonna wait a little bit longer as well because we want to do the faith keeper thing. Death of overwork. Oh. He died in the emergency shift. Wow. Awesome. Hope will rise if I end these though. I'll take that. I need, I need the hope boost. So what can I do? Max that. Um, when we get the people back, we could throw these back in, I suppose. So that's all good. Automaton is strapped in and working there. Very nice. We have to unlock the faith keepers. How can I get... I'm just... I, I need to get more coal. Like, significantly more. Like, is this better for me to do? I guess when I get all the workers, maybe. Change of heart. A man was found crying silently in the temple. We approached him to ask if he needed help. He told us he wanted to see you. I thought my faith died long ago, sir. That's me, guys. Uh, with my wife and daughters in London. I couldn't see any purpose in our new life in the fight for survival. But today when I entered the temple, I saw a future. Now I'm ready to face it. Hell yeah. That sounds like uh, that's good. That's good. Did the Londoners just went go down? I think it might have. I think it might have. Yeah, these people coming back. This is going to be quite nice. Quite, quite nice. Book of Laws. Purpose. Let's go Faith Keepers here. And then we have to build this. 40 wood, 40 steel. Lowers discontent in the whole city. They can organize processions, reduce it further. There can only be one. Discontent will rise. And we have nighttime procession. Discontent will fall when the procession starts after midnight. Get him in there. And I'm going to place this right next to the temple. Okay. The temple looks like it could probably be pushed out pretty significantly. And look, our oh, we're going to drop. We're going to drop. It's going to be so freaking cold. So I'm actually going to go to steam level one here for a bit. To conserve some uh, coal. 
try to get a bit of a surplus going as we go into these colder temps coming up. And then, let's see. We have a lot of wood, so perhaps we do the bunkhouse replacement. That's a steel as well, so I'm going to want to turn this one back on. Get some people there, but we'll get more when these workers arrive. A few are persuaded. A member of the London is talking to a crowd. He's trying to scare as many people into joining the exodus to London, but his visions of doom ring false in the ears of the Peter who are people who are content with the situation. If we let him speak, the number of Londoners rises. Ask a cleric to reassure people, and the number of Londoners will rise slightly. Requires an active guard station or faith keepers, which I'm trying to do. So we'll get the cleric to talk. That's the only option I have that makes any sense there. Let's take a look at our heat situation. So all of these houses that are getting replaced, they're going to be actually really nice and toasty. Temple of Influence influenced people to mend their ways. Good. Good. Okay. Okay, so I do need people here, though. I need a bunch of people there. Let's remove this place. And I'm going to start... We're going to start breaking some of these down anyway. Faith Keepers established. Hope rises. Okay. Let's go, baby. Candles for the wicked. Sir, people are no longer troubled by the Londoners' slogans. Group prayers have strengthened our community. Small candles keep appearing under the slogans. People leave them when they pray for the souls of the Londoners. Awesome. That is excellent to hear, guys. Really, really nice. This is waiting for workers. This is a 24-hour building. Oh, okay, these are... Yeah, because these are all the hunters that were already sent out. People regain hope. Guys, this is sick. The Londoners have failed to persuade anyone to abandon our city and flee. People are recovering from the shock of the news of Winterhome and starting to hope for the future. Nice. And we're going to get people coming in, too, which makes me feel like, you know, maybe... Uh, okay, I'm actually going to switch medical posts here. I'm going to turn this off. Remove the engineers. Um, just because just this is a little bit cleaner to see where these are at. And they're warmer, which is nice. But I wonder if when we get people in, people are going to be like, oh, I'm even more hopeful because look how many of us there are. Look, we're kind of like we're thriving. We're thriving. Fill up the steelworks now. Here comes our hunters. So we are going to have to get our food situation under control. That should be the next thing that we kind of try upgrading. I also just realized I just need net new housing. I need I need housing plus here. Because we have a bunch of people coming in. So... That's cool. But I need a bunch of steel for that. So, yeah. These need to get going. Drafting machine's done. So, let's think about this now. We have a heat situation coming up. That's a problem. So, we could do steam hub range upgrade so the hubs get further range. The generator burns 10% less coal. Pretty good. Allows us to raise the temperature of all heat zones by two levels when the generator is put into overdrive. Interesting as well. Improved heaters. Maybe is maybe that's a decent one for us. That could be decent. The outpost we want to get to. Scouts can move 50% faster is really nice. The factory where automatons and other highly advanced devices can be produced would be sick. Like, so many things are good. Coal mines, advanced mines, 10% more efficient. Maybe that's what I got to do. <laughs> and then we have all the hunting stuff, cookhouse stuff. 
So that's, oh yeah, that's one thing I didn't think about is these hot houses, when I, if I do want to build one, it's only heating level one. So I can't just really replace these. I gotta, I gotta keep them in, like, I gotta keep them heated. So we're gonna need to run more, more um, steam hubs, I think. But if I run the steam hubs over here, I at least only need to run them during the day. So there's that. Oh, and these are freaking massive. I did not know that. All right, well. Let's throw one of these down. And for research, what am I gonna commit to here? I think I'm gonna do heaters, but I need steel. Okay, there's our delivery. So that's actually very excellent timing. Let's go heaters, okay? We got another day until the temperatures are gonna drop to minus 60. Then we're, we have to survive three days on that. I think we can do that. I think we can do that. You guys are all resting. Fine. People are here. Uh, let's send you back out to the fishing village now. You go that way. And then I need homes. Big time. Big time. So, is this the time for me to say, hey, maybe we move some of these things around? And we can utilize these spaces here for the medical posts. The care house has decent insulation as well. I'm wondering if that's what I should do. I'm going to bump that back to here. I'm going to... Dismantle this one. Okay. And we have a, a bunch of extra workers and stuff now, so they can do this during the day. Uh, the medical posts. I think what I'll do is move those over here. And we'll build a steam hub there. Because we're going to have a heating problem. Okay, and then we can dismantle these as well. Just having everything on pause for a moment. Okay, and then I need a cookhouse. And the cookhouse is base heating level one, so... And the cookhouse staying there isn't too bad, I suppose. If I bring the steam hub out here, like I guess that's an option, but... Let's do that, and hopefully that's okay. And then we'll put houses in close here. Okay, so now we got a million kids here. Freshwater springs, go. I'd also like to get into the resource gathering out there. But uh, that's proving to be a bit of a challenge. We're only heating on steam level one right now. Which seems okay. Turn that off. Turn that on. Okay. Then, we have steel. Bunkhouse. 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 Um, maybe that's something I need to upgrade into. Is there, like... There's cookhouse insulation, but, like, houses would be nice. I bet you I could store way more people in there. This seems like the best I have at the moment. 
Uh oh, what's this? Sing Brothers. God. I'm gonna become this really weird, really weird tyrant. Okay, we almost have those off cooldown. Okay. Our tendency is neutral now. That's pretty decent. Um, it's the steel that I really need. Kind of wish I never would have shut that down for a few days there, but... People are hungry, cold at home, corpse disposal. That's all going to be fine soon. Okay. I could further raise discontent with the emergency shifts. I'm just a little concerned. I'll, d I'll just do the extended working hours here. I'm a little concerned about the potential for uh, people dying, right? That's, that's one of the main concerns for me. Let's turn this off and turn that on and maybe I'll do actually need I just need more steel so I just got to be patient here and I'd like to get this housing under control ASAP Rocky steam hub I got one there so I can continue building around that but then I might need some overlap here my streets are kind of messy right here with this rebuild. And I don't know how, well, this is my new hothouse location. These are bunk houses. Let's put engineers in there. So, okay. Oh, wait. So this, oh, okay, right. Let's put the kids in there. And we'll put the heater on. And do I not have a steam hub over there? I don't. So it looks like maybe I should hit that up. With this cold coming in. This is just closed at this time of day. Hmm. This is the care house. That's the one I moved, right? We dismantled the other one? Oh, no. Oh, that's going through medical posts. Yeah, okay, so that's fine. Uh, the cookhouse. Let's put kids in there. Making soup. You know what I could do? We could... Let's go standard meals for a while. Just to keep discontent kind of a little bit more neutral and I'm going to keep these guys staffed because I feel like with all these unhoused that's going to be an issue and then what else the care house is there bunk houses Okay, that's more. Cold homes. Let's heat some homes. Let's heat all homes. You have to start heating nine cold homes. Discontent can rise. Because honestly, this is going to drop and I'll fail it anyways. And I feel like that's going to be worse. So, that's how I'm making that decision. Okay, let's do sermons. Let's do rations. Okay. We're getting up there in the wood department. And see, like at night, we just we just drop all of our coal considerably. Okay, the sick are rising. Makes sense. Like we just talked about. Holy, this is getting... I'm getting nervous, you guys. I'm getting very nervous. Public penance can cause injuries. Discontent will rise. And it looks like you're lashing people. People abandon the Londoners with each use. Each use lowers discontent. 
Okay, that's kind of interesting. But it can cause injuries. So, signing this will raise discontent, but then each time you use it, it, it lowers it. Righteous denunciation. Groups of people will occasionally abandon the Londoners. Small amounts of resources may be uncovered. But discontent will rise. That seems pretty good. I don't need to build anything. Do you have the shrines too, so the efficiencies? I don't know how much that has an impact, but it does raise hope as well. I like this. Righteous denunciation. Done. Decision's been made. Uh, now this steam hub is good, but I need another one over here, I think. These bunkhouses are okay, though. It's not bad. Okay, it's not bad. Is there a way I could see... Yeah, it's these... These little houses all need to get upgraded, eh? Okay. Let's just let her buck. We have a plan. We just need to enact it. So now it's freaking freezing. That's already on. So I need to have a steam hub out there. A new work day starts in the name of God. Are you telling me that this isn't providing enough? Seems like it. If I turn all the heaters on, is that enough? That's still not enough. So that means I have to go level 2. Okay. Got to go level 2. It's going to have some ramp up time there. A woman has revealed that she knows where some of the Londoners gather. We'll act on this information. Some Londoners will be persuaded. Okay, so we're at 35. That's good. Very freaking cold everywhere. We got to survive. We got to ride this out for a few days. Steam hub. Let's go here. Every 20 steel, I'm going to hit that. Our wood is maxed. Don't love that, but not much I can do at this exact moment. Actually, I can. Let's do a bunkhouse. Okay. Improved heaters is on, so that's good timing. That is good timing. My concern is obviously the coal situation. So I'm going to get the automaton gathering that coal. Okay, the steam hubs are coming online. There we go. So that's now functioning. That's great. And we need to get more research happening. What do I want that to be? What do I want that to be? Probably coal mining, honestly. Okay, done. Six hours left. Yikes. Like, how do I solve that, guys? How do I solve that immediately? I'm concerned that I don't. <laughs> I am concerned that I don't. Should I just get another coal thumper up, like, out here? It puts it out behind. Because then I could do two gathering posts there. Food for the hungry. Hope will rise. The hungry will be fed or added to the stockpile. 100 food rations will be added to the stockpile, but hope will fall. I'm going to feed. I'm going to feed people, man. But now I'm concerned about nighttime. This is not a good look for us. So, I need to run. I need to run... Not the wall drill. I need to run our coal mines. Heater's gotta go on. I gotta run this 24 hours. 
It's crazy discontent, I'm aware. Okay, I still have some homeless, unfortunately. Uh, God, it's getting real tough to place houses in here. Where's that other steam hub? Okay, you know what? I can do that, probably. Refusal to work. Let him rest. Discontent will rise or get back to work. It'll rise slightly. Okay, well, it is what it is. Storage is near capacity there. Fine. I could, I could just build tents, but, you know, the problem is it's so freaking cold. I need steel so I can build some uh, storage. Oh, an agitated crowd. Well, a member of the London is stirring up a restless crowd. He's scaring people into joining the Exodus. Exodus. Their discontent with the situation in our city makes his visions of doom all more believable. Oh, God. Disperse. Discontent will rise. People may get hurt. But look at these numbers. I have to disperse. Oh, my God. Discontent's wild right now. Wild right now. Okay, well... If I can make it to here, I can handle it. Let's put the automaton back on there. We have workers, right? So that's not going to be a big issue. Food-wise, we're okay. Coal-wise, we're... Could definitely be better. Here's another thumper, so let's get that operating. And then I'm going to need gathering posts here. I can just put them basically right here. People will get sick, but we have enough for what? I think we can house 50 sick right now? Wait, did I not build a... Oh yeah, I didn't have enough steel. Okay, so in the morning I'll build temple has influenced some people. We're at 31. Love that. Love that. Love that. House of Prayer is good. Okay, that's all good. That's fine. Yep. 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 More engineers there. I'm just wondering, is there anything I'm clearly missing right now? I don't think so. People are definitely getting sick. Let's put the kids out there. No gatherable resources, right? Yep, yeah, that's fine, but we will. We will have that. Coal Thumper, let's heat that as well. Cookhouse is kind of being heated. So, the heat level from this... Is that the same at the steam hubs? We could do range. Powered by the generator, each contraption create additional smaller heat zones around them. Yeah, so we're going to go into the efficiency upgrade, I think. After the coal mining, just to really lock that down and now we have more sick than I can help so that's a little bit of a problem three hours left but then people are going to go to work food theft someone stolen 41 food rations people are saying it was the Londoners gathering gathering supplies we may recover or we let them be no we send the faith keepers I can't I can't rise discontent anymore Oh, these places are running 24 hours, actually. Okay, but this is going to be online. So there's that. People are furious. 
two days to lower discontent. Man. I'm gonna try, guys. Give me give me a couple days. 75%. Okay. Okay. The overtime's gonna stop. Right? People are sick. That's a bit of a that is a problem that, that I don't know that I can address right away. Unless I build some more hospitals, which I do have engineers. It's just now it's a cost thing because I need to have the steelworks up and running, but it will be during the day. So now that people are going to work, our coal is going to slowly stabilize. I hope. Uh, oh, you know what I might need? I might need another fighting arena. That's, that would be great. And it's only 15 wood. So I'll throw one here. And... Let's see. It's kind of hard to tell where that should be. Throw one here. Throw one there. This coal situation is stressing me big time. Okay, so we'll connect that up. This resource depot we got for wood. So that's fine. Okay, we have this one that's doing wood. That's fine. Steel is coming in decently fast now. That's good. Oh, man. Uh, maybe I can go to, to steam level one for the day just to kind of chill things out. Literally. Food for overtime work. Hope will rise. You know what? Yes. I'm just not going to run any emergency shifts. <laughs> so, yeah, sure. Let's see if this has an impact. We got some gravely ills. Okay, explorer. We got steam cores, maybe. The fishing village used to supply Tesla City with food. Searching it, we found a letter. Mike, don't return to the city. Tesla's a madman. He cast out all the amputees, all the sick. Jerry's parents and old Beth are among them. There will be blood, that's for sure, and soon. The village was left in order. We should send a team there to start fishing. Leave the village intact. So it can be an outpost. That's what I really need as well. That's what I really need. Okay, so now I'll go to Tesla City. God, there's uh, we just need we just need so many things. It's insane. We don't have enough food there. Okay. Engineers there. Um, let's do the remaining bunk houses here. Okay. So I have just enough for that. We do have the um, the fighting arenas going up. A lying child. Oh my god. A girl is asked to speak with you. She's crying and repeating that her mother is innocent. I lied. I lied to the priest. I'm so sorry. I told him my mom said you're a damn fool and I'll burn in hell. But I was just mad at her. I made it all up. Don't punish her. Ooh. I'm actually going to take the discontent drop. I don't know if that's crazy. Yeah, okay. So we're losing hope because of all the discontent. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, when can I get more prayers going? Soonish. Coal mining. Okay, so that's pretty timely, I would say. Outpost depots. I need 20 iron. Or steel, sorry. Let's do that. That 
that's gonna drop some discontent there. Good. Oh boy. I still need a, a cemetery situation as well, but hey, I need to figure out other things right now. Discontent rises, but I can do this to lower discontent. This raises hope, and then I have to build three shrines. I just don't... I'm a little concerned that I can't afford to have discontent go up at all. Maybe I could go dueling laws here. If people die, people die. Okay? But I need to reduce the discontent. Duels are legal. Good luck, everyone. We should see drops at dinner time here, right? And these houses should reduce some of this stuff. Okay, people have mended their ways. Good. Look, discontent. It's kind of happening. Kind of happening. People are sick AF. Scouts are in Tesla. Okay. City's modern and meticulously built. A tall tower emits a constant barrier of lightning, deflecting the incoming snow, but nobody comes out to greet us. Thunder unleashed. Able minds and bodies will prevail over the cold, reads the slogan over the entrance to Tesla City. A central tall tower shines with the blue glow of electric discharges, which form a protective dome over the town. But something went wrong here. There are charred bodies lying in the streets, and the stench of burned flesh taints the air. We saw a lightning streak from the tower, hitting a building and leaving a gash in its roof. Dreadnought landing. We risk entering the city. Try to disable the electric charge or stay away. Search the outskirts. I just, I don't know what this means. This means I could potentially lose my scout. Let's search the outskirts. I'm not in a rush. We search the outskirts. It seems that nobody survived inside, but some people might have escaped. Hmm. Dreadnought landing. Along the shore of the frozen bay, we can see an outline of an enormous ship. A wide lane of broken ice leads to it from the west. Give her. Okay. I only have a day for the discontent. Frick. Man, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Honestly. I don't know if that's going to work or not. Um, well. Where's my automaton? Where is my automaton? He's refueling. He's working at the coal thumper. Yep. Oh, was I looking at the wrong coal thumper? Yes. Yes, I was. Let's get him gathering that stuff throughout the night. Whoa, generator shutting down. Oh, that's not good. It's not good. That's not good. How do I solve that? May retrieve some stolen food. Yep. Faith keepers could succeeded. Three days to sign the public penance law. Banish him. Discontent will rise. We'll try public penance law. I have one homeless. Okay, we are bringing in some extra coal now. Okay. Actually, it's probably faster for me to just do it through here. I'm hoping now with those all those outposts and stuff on I can create like just a little bit of a surplus. We'll put workers here too. And then hospitals are a problem. 
Some Londoners are persuaded to stay. Okay, that's down to 22. I'm not going to get the discontent down here. I have 16 hours, and I'm, I have no... Okay, these are off, so there's that. That's good for hope. Cold at home. I could turn that up, I suppose. And I need maybe another bunkhouse. Way out here. Maybe the lashings would have been the way to go, but I didn't want to see the discontent rise, right? So, kind of sucked. More survivors. Let's, um, send them. I'm not going to escort. Oh, but I don't have anywhere else for you to go. Oh, yeah, I do. Frozen Grove. Okay. This is sweaty. I'm very concerned. No gatherable resources. Okay. Cut off an amputee. We have a frightened patient. He's refusing amputation. Keeps screaming, doesn't want anyone to touch his leg, and he won't change his mind, even though gangrene will kill him. Amputee. Sorry, buddy. It's gotta happen. How many engineers do I have? Because if I build some hospitals here... I mean... I have I have I have engineers doing other things, so I will try to do this. This is a sign that man, we just need to make it till tomorrow. And then temperatures going up. Okay. Temperature will improve. Um steam hub there, steam hub there, steam hub there. Steam hub there, steam hub there. Does this area have one? Yeah, he's on it. I'll try to keep these guys warmer. The problem is, yes, of course, these take up more fuel, right? So, yeah, I mean, that it, it's an issue, definitely. Explore the Dreadnought Landing. Hello, look at all this stuff. Found a place the hull bolted to a boulder. It's engraved with the following inscription. In the year 1886, the American expedition aboard Hephaestus landed here in search of a haven from the global glaci glaciation. May God preserve the souls of our fellow countrymen who perished on our way to our sister ship Prometheus. Now, what do we have on these guys currently? Nothing on you. You've got steel and trees and cores that I don't really need. So I can send you out, I guess... Research facility, icy corridor. Let's go to the research station. And I just realized this is this video is now very long. It's my bad. But um, we're going to wrap it up here, guys. Wish me luck. I don't think I'm going to be able to lower this discontent in time, unfortunately, unless these sermons come in and just kick absolute ass. I do have the ceremonial service that I can do. That will... Okay, that was a pretty significant drop. So maybe all hope is not lost, but it's not looking amazing. Guys, wish me luck. Bye for now.